another Sunday. Welcome to It Is What It Is Sports Show. We have our main man, Charlton, our other main amigo down there, the Italian Don. <laughs> and of course, you got myself. Uh, Hot show. Um, You know how we do. Um, <laughs> cool, so let's get into it. <laughs> let's get into it straight away. Um, Jermaine, I know you wanted to talk about a few games in the NBA, so do you want to take us away? Thanks. Raptors are up free zit on, on the nets. That to yeah. me, it's going to be a, a clean sweep by the Raptors. The experience is showing there. Honorable oh, highlight. But, but just to interrupt, sorry, I just know that. Oh, you're getting the broom, yeah, like Chuck. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, I do feel like the nets, obviously, they're missing their two best players. And then they're missing like another guy, Dinwiddie. They're missing Kyrie and they're missing Durant. So I don't really give them much of a chance, but they held their own. So, mm. yeah. Uh, holding their own, yeah, free nil sweeper. Okay. <laughs> um, next game, Pacers versus Heat. Um, yeah, both teams playing well, but Heat just seems to have a bit more fire. Give me a bucket, bucket, <laughs> give me a bucket. <laughs> a little rivalry there between him and um, TJ, TJ Warren, TJ Warren. TJ Warren. Yeah, that that made the, that made the series interesting, but. Yeah, yeah, they, they haven't turned up. Yeah, they haven't turned up, man. Nah, man. What, did, what, did, what, did, what did Jimmy say? Oh, he's soft, man. He's soft. Oh. <laughs> that alone should make you turn up. You know, like that. But anyway, keep moving. Let's move on. Yes. Thunder versus Rockets. Uh, game three was an interesting one. Thunder taking over in overtime to win. Um, My guy, Shy. Shay. Gilded. Yeah, he's good. Yeah, he's good. He's good. Alexander. He's good. Yeah, he's good. He's good. He's good. He's good. 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 Next game we have in hand, Magic versus Bucks. Bucks are back in charge after going the first game down in the series. And then, yep. you know, over the last two games, Giannis doing Giannis things. 32 points, 16 rebounds and six assists over the um, game two and three. That's what Giannis got to Kumpo. That's what you guys are getting. <laughs> what did my, I saw a video of him the other day saying, you know, I'm a freak. <laughs> and his girl is bare getting on to him, bro. His girl's getting on to him, bro. Why do you uh, why are you saying that? Why are you saying that? <laughs> With a little yeah, bell from the guy. little bell is like yeah, 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 that video, that video, yeah. yeah. Hey. But, yeah let's, but that's typical Yannis. Two time MVP. I'm expecting him to be the second uh second year in a row uh, MVP. So I expect nothing less to be honest. Yep, I hear you. Um, fi final, no, no, not final game, sorry. Next game, Nuggets oh. versus Jazz. Jazz coming back and taking the, the um, game two, oh, sorry, game two and three. Guys, how do you feel about that? If, even if you want to cover it. Listen, congratulations to uh, Matt Connolly with his son. <laughs> yeah, um, but he came back with a vengeance. Man was just hitting them threes like there was no tomorrow. Um, you know, Donovan Mitchell's gonna do his thing, like that. Rudy Gobert's gonna do his thing, previous defensive player of the year. But I can't lie, I'm disappointed with Denver. They've got Michael Porter Jr., my guy, they've got um, the Joker, they've got um, the point guard, Murray. Paul Millsap. So they're, they're not they're not playing to the level or you know on paper you think it, you're thinking to yeah, the these expectations. Are like serious, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. But maybe the pressure's getting to them, or maybe they just maybe they're trying to give the Jazz a head start in it and make it competitive. I don't know, but <laughs> I've been disappointed with them. So hopefully they step it up next game. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Just wrapping up what kind of Samaj was saying. You know, we speak. We broke. We speak. We spoke briefly on Mike Conley's return and in game three he led the team in points over mm -hmm. 24 so yeah shout out, to, shout out to him um, Donovan Mitchell you know got to highlight him playing out of his socks as he normally does and 
in game three, Jazz outscored Nuggets in every quarter. Let's just highlight that. So, mm -hmm. yeah. You know, the Total Mike domination, man. Total domination. Total domination. And because Mike Conley's come back, that's just giving him another uh, scoring option as well. I feel like he's balanced it now. Like, I feel like yeah, yeah, Donovan, yeah. Mitchell, Donovan Mitchell don't have to do too much now because he has Mike behind him. Beside him, so and also when he's on the bench, yeah, Matt can take can... over, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they can maintain that lead whilst whilst he's mm -hmm. on the bench. So that's a, it's a smart, smart idea. I like it. Smart idea. Mm -hmm. But going on to a different game, a game I thought would have been a bit more interesting, lads. I'm not going to lie. Celtics versus 76ers. From when those that the the young core from both squads came into the um, Celtics and um, 76ers. Joel Embiid, Ben Simmons, Tatum, Jalen Brown. We expected, I don't know, they met in the playoffs like, what, two years? Two years mm -hmm. now? Mm -hmm. And I don't know, their last performance was, I don't know, it showed something. It showed great potential for the future to kind of say, this is going to be a great rivalry between these two teams. But mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't feel like it's happening in this series. I've, Celtics are just... Nah, uh, man, I feel like they... Listen, man, I feel like they just had a little... A little like, you know, uh, it is what it is type of thing, you know. Like, if I look, I'm looking at the stats right now. Most of them didn't even do much, really. Well, Jalen Brown had about 21 points, seven rebounds. Uh, Marcus mm -hmm. had 14 points. Kemba Walkoff, 20, 24. Your boy JT from only had 15 and six rebounds. Uh, they just see us as walk in the park, to be honest. And then you got a hard-working... <laughs> Uh, MB for trying to hold it down. He had 30 points and 13 mm -hmm. rebounds. Still wasn't good enough for, to be to be the Boston Celtics. At this point, they know they got this right now. Yeah, they, they're gelling as a team. Right? And as you can see, what I was saying, as you, as you can see from what I was saying from the um, the stats, they know they got this in the bag, and it's going to be a sweep tonight. Like I said, sweep, sweep. Um, for me. I'm not even going to mention stats because sometimes I feel like when we focus on stats, it overlooks the other deficiencies. And I just feel like the 76ers, I don't know if they're, they're not working hard enough, but they just don't, they're already missing their, one of their main guys. But I don't see the others like saying, you know what, all right, cool, it's us against the world. Let's help and be, let's give our all out there. Obviously, we, we're only assuming like they prob they probably are, but if that's the case and they're giving their all, then the quality is just it's just not good enough. Then, um, if everyone's giving a hundred percent effort, and then um, you're getting you're still losing the way how you're losing, then it's just down to quality at the end of the day. So, forget about the stats with these lot. I just feel like they need to either try harder or get better players. That's it. That's all I have to say on them lot. Mm -hmm. On the back of that, um, are we? Is it really? A, is it really a, play, a player's problem? I know Joel, 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 sorry, Joel. Who the hell is that? Um, Joel Embiid is looking tired, having to carry a lot of the load. Um, but is Brett Brown's job in question? As as, as you know, head coach. Man, we all know he's in trouble, man. He's in trouble. Man. Oh. He, has, he has. He's had how many years to 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 put this team together? You have. You have what? Mm -hmm. Um, Joel Embiid and, and Ben Simmons, well, bro, and then Tobias Harris and got our whole foot, bro. <laughs> you're meant to something's meant to happen, and it's not. And as as from right now, I can tell someone else, another coach can come in and and do something better with these lot. I know they can make it uh, to the finals, I guess, in the Eastern Conference Finals at least, or against the Bucks. But with this team, man, you should be able to go to the finals. And he's not doing it right now. It's just going to be a sweet. He's he's gone. He's gone by next season. That's what I'm saying. Gone. For me, obviously, I don't want no one to lose their job. It's never a good time to lose their job or whatever. Um, <laughs> but I mean, what did they say? Is, what did they say is insanity when he tried the same thing over and over again, and uh, you're expecting different results? Um, of course, this. This bubble is, is an exception. Um, he's missing one of his best offensive talents and best defensive talent because obviously um, he can guard positions one to five. What's his name? Uh, Donnie, that's injured. 
Ben Simmons, ben Simmons. yeah. Ben Simmons. Left my, yeah, he's getting left my... Uh, he can guard from one to five. Um, so they've lost uh, a big cog in their wheel. Um, so, yeah, for me, I just think it's, it's just a very unfortunate... It's a very unfortunate series. Very unfortunate um, situation. Um, so, yeah. I mean... I'm glad I'm not in that position to make that decision, isn't it? <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, it's not, it's, not, it's, not looking, it's not looking too uh, rosy for him in the future, let's just say that. It's not looking too promising for him. Yeah. No, and he is keep trying the same thing over again and expecting different, same results. Different results, really. Yeah. So, I mean, that's it. Yeah, he kind of clinched it with that one. Um, mm-hmm. something, something a bit closer to home for you, um, you know. So much. Um, Clippers yeah. seem to be back in the driver's seat. Yes. Uh, yeah, but I'm not getting carried away, you know? I'm not getting carried away <laughs> because uh, it was the other day, school, boy. My, mate, my mate over there in the blue top, not calling no names, and he's wearing glasses and the, uh, the chain. Uh, he was over there. He was gloating. He was gloating when we lost, you know? Posting all on social media and... Then the Lakers won, and he was going. Wait, 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 wait. We don't celebrate. We don't celelebrate one game. You know what I mean? We'll wait till we get to the championship. You know. Um, I said it from the start. Luka Doncic, very good. Paul Zingis, very good. Um, I expected them to challenge us. Um, but to keep it short, just one game, another victory. We keep moving. See you at work. Then we go to game three. Say what? Oh, game three. Yeah, game three. Yeah, I'm, I'm, we, we won game three. I know, we're two on ahead. Obviously, game four is tonight. Um, the only thing, I am a little bit worried about Paul George. That's it. But apart from that, Kawhi's going to put us on his back. Yeah. Like that. Like a camel. And he's going to take us to the promised land. He's going to take us to the Egyptian pyramids. And we're going to get them the gold. You know that? So, yeah, man. It, it, I, I'm, I'm calm. I'm humble. Oh, I'm relaxed. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, we don't gloat over one little victory. Nah, we're, we're not that guy over there. <laughs> Luka Duntic is hard, bro. <laughs> He's hard, bro. He's, <laughs> it's 2 2, boy. I'm telling you, it's 2 2. I, I, know you're root, I know you're rooting for him. I know you're rooting for him. You know, because you don't want to buck us. You don't want to buck us. <laughs> you don't want to if you buck us, yeah. If you, if you buck us in the final, oh my God. Oh my God. What do you mean, oh my God? <laughs> In, in saying that though, in saying that though, get out of here, bro. Yeah, Charles make a valid point, you know. I pref- I like, oh, with Porzingis' performance recently in game two and three, playing out of his socks as well, you know, shooting the tray well, efficient, mm-hmm. um, and then that second scoring option that they need. So, we do, you know, it does put into question, it does put into question would it have changed the momentum of the, um, the series if Porzingis wasn't ejected in, in game one? But of course, that's something well, just to he's be... Been in, well, he's been, in, he's been in two games and he's won one and he's lost one, isn't it? So, we don't know. We need a bigger sample size to see. Um, but uh, what I would say, we have no answer for him. He's seven foot two. Like, our big Zubok is smaller than him. And if he brings him out to the, to the three-point line, he's just going to shoot over him. He can't stop seven foot two shooting a three-point. I don't know who's going to stop that. You know what I'm saying? So, we always knew he was going to be a problem but for me I feel like they just upped their defensive intensity and um, they're like okay Paul Zingis is going to score Luca's going to score but we're not going to make the rest score and just two people alone can't beat the Clippers you know what I'm saying you need more shooters and you need more um, reliable um, what's it called supporting cast so yeah yeah I think a key attribute here for that, um, for that series is definitely experience as well um, mm-hmm. you know Hawaii, Paul George, and X, Y, Z, Pat Bev, um, the rest of those people that have playoff experience previously with their coach as well, as we've highlighted before in previous mm-hmm. um, little, yeah, previous discussions. Um, but in, to wrap this up in one word, yeah, how do you feel about Duncan's injury in Game Three with his left, with his ankle? Unfortunate. In one word. It's unfortunate, bro. <laughs> yeah, he's more like he's more like over he's overjoyed boy no, like, woo! Yeah, he's, he's no, no 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 wait wait wait, wait. Uh, 
I don't wish injury on nobody. And I was the one who told you no, about no, Luka no, Doncic. No, 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 it's man. It's, it's only convenient okay, when, when he's not playing because, against your yeah, team, bro. Because, yeah, if we win the series without without Luka Doncic playing, they're going to be like, ah, oh, there was no Luka Doncic, there was no Luka Doncic. We're gonna, we want to beat yeah, you, man, fair and square. Well, well we're still going to say that anyway because he's not going to be 100%, so... This is one game, I'm saying it. <laughs> I mean, he came we can off... Beat, listen, we can only beat what's in front of us, innit? He came off, yeah. He was out. Pazingas? Pazingas. Yeah, when and the they game, were still on the charge. When he came Brian, out... Well, only Curry, by eight points. Hardaway Jr., they made a little... Run. No, no, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. He even, he even had a triple-double. Luca had a triple-double, bro. And then he left the game for the second time. So I don't want to hear this nonsense, innit? Well, Zinga's tried, boy. It's just points, one bro. win. It's just unfortunate. Jermaine, let me stop talking. It's unfortunate. Okay, yeah. let's go. What Jermaine is missing? Missing. It's anyway, reason. Frozen, well bro. Frozen, frozen, bro. Frozen, frozen. What? <laughs> anyway, let's go. <laughs> let's keep it moving. Let's keep let's it moving. Keep just moving, guys. Simple. Look at him. Yeah, at yeah, him. I know. Bad beef. Anyway, what, 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 what was that thing when you when um what was it? You doing the mannequin challenge? Yeah, his wife yeah, 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 the yeah. mannequin challenge. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, we go to the next game. Back? No. Oh, oh he's gone. Uh, he's gone. All right, he's cool. gone. Okay. Anyway, next game. Uh, mm-hmm. the Lakers versus the Portland Trailblazers. Um, mm-hmm. it was a monstrous game in Game Three. Um. Mm-hmm. The Lakers came with uh, 116 and the Trailblazers came with uh, 108 with mm-hmm. a two monstrous game with LeBron mm-hmm. and AD. LeBron come with 38 points, 12 rebounds, eight assists, two steals with your boy AD come over 29 points, 11 rebounds, eight assists and two steals. Whew. Mm-hmm. What is your thought in this game? So much. Um, I thought it was a very I don't know, like the score doesn't tell the true story, you know, because yeah, they had very good stats, but LeBron could have had a 40, 50 point triple double. You know, A D should mm-hmm. could have had forty points himself. Um they were just missing bare free throws, bare, bare free throws. And um I just Everyone was knocking our shots. I mean, KCP is back, knocking our shots. Um, Caruso was, I know his name mm-hmm. is Caruso, but we call him the Caruso. Caruso. He was, just, he was just officiating the offense. And I'm like, yeah, like, you know? So, yeah, it's I was impressed. Time. But, I mean, the Portland Trailblazers, I think they were just getting in foul. Everything was just, they were just getting in foul trouble a lot and giving them too much free throws. Too um, many free throws. So, that's what just kept... Um, Lakers in the game until late on, until they just took it over and then they never looked back. I mean, uh, uh, like I was there off camera, was watching the game, and I, I, I was I was getting stressed. I was getting stressed because mm-hmm. AD, AD had a lot of free throws. He won a lot of free throws, mm-hmm. and he wasn't getting them in, and it was bothering me. Mm-hmm. Same as LeBron and CJ McCollum, and, and they still mm-hmm. able to hit the freeze with his. Fractured uh, dislocated, um, finger. Dis- dis- dislocated finger. I'm just thinking, oh, like, what's going on? Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Someone's come back in. Looks like he's come back in. <laughs> what happened, mate? Guys, yeah? He's saying the bouncer let you back in, yeah? Uh, yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> I looked up at the sky and I wondered why. My internet is so rubbish. I'm telling you. <laughs> No oh, internet are you with Sky? Are you with Sky? I'm not saying nothing, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we will say we'll say about the Lakers game. Um, CJ McCollum and, and, and Dame Dollar, man. Like AD and LeBron were giving them a chance. They're missing too many free throws. I mean, yeah. I mean they were in foul trouble. It, it, was, it was beneficial for us, but um, 
I was I was getting stressed, man. You can't you can't be doing this. You can't be doing this in the playoffs because no, another team that would have been a game game over. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, um, I'm glad it was it was game one. Um, it's something to game sorry, yeah, game one. I mean not game one. Sorry, round one. Sorry, round one. Mm-hmm. Sorry. Um, but um, we should all learn from this. I mean, they should learn from this. Um, I mean, it was a, it was a great game. Great game in the second half. For um, LeBron and, um, um, and and AD, you know, um, monstrous game, monstrous game, and um, the back the back team as well with Crusoe and uh, we're talking about Danny Green hitting the threes finally. Hallelujah! Yeah. Um, uh, Shout out even, K- get one point. Shout what? out KCP. Shout out KCP getting more than one point. Anyway, hallelujah, man, for that. Um, yeah. They they can't they can't do that in the next 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 round. Please, we can't have that. We can't have that. Um, so no. yeah, I'm, I'm really happy. Um, game four, we just just got just do the same thing. And game four, if Portland doesn't win that game four, it's it, it's a wrap. Yeah, it's they a wrap. have to win game four. Mm-hmm. Or they're going to be Lakers are going to be three one ahead. I don't think they'll let that lead slip. So it's a oh. it's a either win or go home. Yeah. For, um, Lakers win um, game three and I don't know if you guys covered this but Anthony Davis yeah. right now is showing why he's considered as a top five player in the NBA I mean I'm not game... convinced yet though I'm waiting no. I'm not, nah you know, not yet at, no, um, he's, got, he's got the talent you know what it is he's got the talent he's just not consistent with it if he was consistent with it good god yeah, yeah. Right. then then <laughs> then I would be worried he's just not consistent like you know what I mean because even yeah, the first man. half, let's be real. First half, he had what eleven points, and then it was that second half where he went dumb. He went bonkers, and then I was like, "Ah, oh, you know what? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah." <laughs> I think we have no answer for AD. It's true. Over over game two and three, he led the team in points and rebounds. He averaged mm-hmm. what thirty points and eleven rebounds over both games, and just you know what it was, Frank Vogel. He made a tactical switch. I don't know if people have noticed yeah. it. They played AD at the five. You know what I mean? Playing him at so centre. If you're, yeah, if you're playing him at the five at the centre, he's quicker than Nur- Nurkic. He mm-hmm. can shoot from the three. So if anyone does come out and guard him from the three, he's too big. And Nurkic, when he's going, uh, when he's posting him up, he's too slow. So <laughs> there's no answer for AD. So, yeah. Yeah. Nurkic is, a, Nurkic is a baller, though. Let's, let's put that there. He is. Oh, Nurkic. yeah, yeah. Ando, Ando. Yeah, Nurkic is nice. Ando. But, of course, they're missing also. They're missing Zach Collins. He can't, he, he can't seem to, you know, fucking... Yeah, they're but, missing Trevor Ariza, yeah. Rodney Hood. They're missing a couple players, but so are, so are the Lakers, and they're getting it done. So, mm-hmm. it is and, what it is. And, of course, I know, Charlton is, I know Charlton is happy seeing, you know, LeBron hit um, playoff mode. That freight train is back. Yeah, he's doing his thing you, right now. As you can see from my face, I expected this already. So. Oh, see you two, yeah. And you might not want to talk about talk, you No, no, about, wait, wait. He, wait. He's trying to take my stance in it because, yeah, I was, I was, I've been humble though. But ask, ask, ask the viewers when they watched it. Chan is not humble. <laughs> I am humble. I'm humble, you, that's I'm, I'm humble I'm, of all, fam. I've That's been why... humble. Oh, Charlton. Oh. When have I ever been not, not been humble? I've no, always humble, bro. Aside, in one word, yeah, yeah. How happy are you? Or how do you feel about Lillard dislocating his finger? In one word, Charlton. Not happy, bro. You're not meant to be happy <laughs> for someone getting injured. Bro, that's someone's <laughs> hand, bro. <laughs> you're, both <laughs> you're both capping. You're both calling. No, no, you see this guy here? Uh, wh- He's what? He's trying to copy me, fam. Yeah, no, nah, uh, man's, man's hurt. Nah. He's, in the He's happy that a man's hurt. That's pain, bro. The point, the impact on the, impact <laughs> on the players. <laughs> Would you write the question? Yeah? <laughs> what, in one word... What is your feeling? Ah, uh, you know what? Forget it. I, <laughs> it. <laughs> I just think it's unfortunate. But to be honest, it didn't really affect. I didn't see. I don't. Um, I couldn't really tell if it was affecting him or not because he still got his what thirty plus points for the game. Was that what? How much? How much points did he get? Thirty. 
something like 31? that. Ooh. I know he got 30 plus. Let- I know he got 30 plus. So. 30 mm-hmm. plus. And he had help. And Melo was balling in the third quarter. Man had six. Yeah, six aye, you see the deal? jumpers. Woo! LeBron and and, so, and, and he and brought it within Mello. one point. So yeah, LeBron versus Melo. So it was. But yeah, man. I mean, the Lakers were too dominant. Too dominant. And, yeah. and again, another another word for uh, Lillard. Unfortunate, man. Unfortunate. Another word. Oh yeah. Okay. That sums up game two and three and, you know, what we think. Um, we, see, we might be seeing a couple of sweeps tonight. <laughs> then again, we might not. <laughs> we yeah. just got to, we got to wait and see, but, you know. Well, we're going to wait to uh, game four. Um, and we'll see you guys again. I'm with my guys, Jermaine, Smudge, Subway Charts. It is what it is. And we out. It is what it is, man. Yes.